guys, today I'll be unboxing Taemin. This is his fourth mini album, Guilty. I have everything here, as you can see, the two photo book versions, the archive box version, the digipack, and the SM mini. Taemin is part of my alt group, so obviously I'm very excited. So let's get into it. The photo book version names are Guilty and Riz. And then, yeah, I already said this is the archival box, and it looks like a shoe box, which is really cool and unique. So I'm extra excited to go through that one. But we'll start with the photo book versions. These two right here. This one is really soft and this one is more smooth. So we'll go through this one first. It's a very nice cover. <laughs> is that an ice? Right. And the back. I guess it is an ice. It's like um summer version. And there's the track list there. Obviously, this album, as we all expected, was so good, amazing, but I'd say my favorite b-side is- I had to pause it for a second because I was like a little confused. I was like, wait, the song's not called She Loves Me, She Loves Me. I was so confused, but actually the word not is right over here. I was like, hold on a minute, and I paused. I was like, wait, but yeah, no, I, I didn't notice it's like separated. So yeah, She Loves Me, She Loves Me Not, and so it's between that one and Not Over You. Those two, I don't, I, I really love both, so I'm not sure which one, so I'm going to say those two at the moment, but I also really like blue. That one's nice too, so I'd say those are like my top faves, but obviously it's, it's always pretty hard to pick favorite Tainan songs because they're all so equally good. I hope this is okay. My, um, my table here is not the biggest table in the world so big albums like this don't fit that well in frame okay i'm really liking this version so far it's bringing me back to summer and summer is my favorite season so oh my god he looks so good here i love the fish islands who else is obsessed with guilty I think it's like one of my favorite Taemin titles now, but to be honest, all of his titles are just like number one for me. It's as good as I expected it to be. And the dance too, oh my gosh, like I just cannot get over the dance. And he does all these like TikTok dance challenges with other idols and it's like, it's different to like see other idols do something like this. Obviously it's very fitting for Taemin, like this kind of concept. It suits him so well, obviously. And I just love this side of him because, he, you know, he's also like opposite of that, you know, like he's a cute little taemin you know? <laughs> like, and But he really shows his professional side in this, um, in this release, if, if you know what I'm trying to say. Wow, this page is really thin. The lyrics page is here. Oh yeah, the Rizness is also an interesting song. <laughs> I actually like it. It's like, I feel like it wouldn't be everyone's cup of tea, but um, I feel like people either love it or don't like it. I actually like it, so, but yeah. <laughs> I was definitely shocked when I first saw that, um, like, song title. Because, <laughs> yeah, that's like... That's something I don't have. I don't have Riz. I know Taemin has Riz, obviously. <laughs> he had Riz even before the song came out. Or maybe sometimes he doesn't. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm sure he does. <laughs> don't worry, not having Riz is not a bad thing. He looks so sun-kissed here. I just love this kind of weather. I love seeing bright blue sky. No clouds in the sky like I see pretty much every day. That's such a nice photo. He is absolutely stunning. You can tell he mm, like worked out a lot for this comeback because he has those abs that we can see very clearly. We saw he's been working out with Mino a lot. I don't know if a lot is the right word, but he's definitely been out with him. And you know, Mino is out in the gym like almost every day, so. Helping Timin get into shape for his comeback. He worked hard, uh, you can tell. Like on everything for this comeback. This kind of actually reminds me of the concept for hard a little bit, doesn't it? 
Okay, so far I'm really liking this version. But I already know I'm going to like the other version too. It's going to be just as nice, but he's so stylish all the time. And like, he just, like, his jawline is so, like, perfect. <laughs> it's what I aspire my jawline to be. <laughs> okay. But it's, I hope it wasn't too annoying that it's, like, a little bit cut off here, but what can you do? He's so cute, isn't he? You get a poster, typical SM fashion, adding a poster. Oh my god, he's so cute. Really, really badly want to hang this. He has such nice arms. <laughs> like, I don't know, they're like so, they just look nice. And to me, like, nice arms aren't like really big muscles. I just, like, think he has a nice looking arm. <laughs> now that is the most random compliment, but it definitely is. And we have the CD. Looks like his popsicle kind of melted. Such a cute CD. I was playing my um, CDs on my player, like CD player, on the weekend because I was reorganizing my room. So anytime I reorganize my room, I like to play CDs on my CD player. <laughs> it gives me motivation to keep going and cleaning my room. <laughs> and we have the SM ad. I was there at Kwangya. I went to Korea in June and it was right before a Chinese hard comeback and I was there. So <laughs> I just lo love to point it out every time. Okay, photo card. Is that the back or the front? Oh, is that the front? I think it might be. Okay, we got, oh, it's the back. We got, oh my gosh. Okay, my brother is talking in the back. I really couldn't even be bothered to tell him to shut up, but look how cute. Oh my gosh, I love, I don't know what it is about photo cards of idols when they're in their like stage outfit with the mic on. I don't know what it is about that that I like so much, but um, yeah, I actually really like the yellow and white together. I don't know why. Why does his heart look like a bird? I feel like that's how we all drew birds when we were in elementary school. We just drew them like this, <laughs> like crows or something. Anyways, okay. That was the first version. I'm so sorry, I forgot this. <laughs> I actually saw it when I pulled it out earlier, then I set it to the side and I forgot about it. So you get this as well, little film strip or whatever they're calling it these days. <laughs> Next we have the Riz version. I like the cover of this one because I like his striped shirt. <laughs> he looks really cute in it. Also, I love his um, brown hair this comeback. Really, really love the brown hair. And actually the way it's styled, is really cute, I think. It's kind of like long down here, almost like a mullet, I think. And if you know me, I was never really a fan of mullets, but this is actually such a cute hairstyle. Like to me, it's really cute. These headphones are so in. Oh yeah, when this um concept photo first got posted, I was questioning what happened here. <laughs> like what happened there? Did Kung take a bite out of his headphones? Anyways. Um, he looks like me in Japan. <laughs> I got my vlogging camera, just vlogging everywhere. And when I was in Korea too. Oh, that's such a soft look. So this is called the Riz version, but I feel like this is a more like softer, kind of like um, down to earth, everyday guy kind of vibe photo book. But the first one seemed like he had a lot of Riz. <laughs> I mean, he still looks like he has it here too. Can't stop the dance. Ooh, such an aesthetic photo. Me, if I was walking the streets here and I saw Taman, quickly take out my phone, snap a photo. I like that the pages change, change feeling. Is that a random white man? Is he filming in some residential area in America or something? Oh. Hello. <laughs> why is oh wait, why is he so cute in this? Yeah, I love this song. I don't know. I feel like this one actually might be my favorite. Which one do you guys like, or which ones do you like? Of course, it's so hard. Oh, <laughs> I can never finish my sentence when he's attacking me like this. 
Ah, yes, this photo shoot. <laughs> this photo shoot. Oh, yes. He is a very nice torso, I must admit. What it, What is happening here? Okay, we, we won't question it too much. Because this is taming after all. He does some very questionable things. Ah. <laughs> These are very nice photos. <laughs> ah, very nice. Oh, where is he? He's in some abandoned house? He looks so nice here. That's such a, like a boring word to describe, but no, he looks really, really good. Oh my gosh. I'm kind of at a loss for words at him, to be honest. Yeah, the brown hair. I just love that both him and Ki and Onyu had brown hair for their latest solo comebacks. And then all of their comebacks before that, they had different hair colors. For Killer, Ki had blonde hair. For Dice, Onyu had orange hair. And then for Advice, Taemin had like mixed color hair. He had the long like extensions that were like blonde and kind of like mixed. Their comebacks after their latest comebacks, they all had kind of like the same color brown hair. Yeah, I love that. Mino had brown hair too. His was a little bit darker than the other three here. But yeah, but not Jonghyun. Jonghyun had blonde hair for, um, for Shining. What's up with these constant teases? Is that a... Is that cactus? Like, I don't know, like shots like this. He looks so flawless. So flawless. I'm like hoping Shiny can go on a world tour, honestly. But I actually would not want it to happen if Onyu would not be able to participate. We'll see how things go with his health. I did hear rumors like with like the leaked SM schedule and everything that he was going to return. So um, let's hope for the best because I heard that he's going to have like a solo comeback. So obviously he, he will return. But I want him to be fully healthy before he returns. Because his health obviously is the number one priority. Oh, I forgot to bring my mic a little closer. I hope it wasn't too far away. I don't know if I just made a difference bringing it a little closer, but my, it's actually over there, so you'll probably hear more of the album sounds than my voice, but that's okay. <laughs> that's what I prefer. Okay, that was that poster. We got this one. Oh, see, we got Taemini in here. <laughs> There's two different sides to him. And we love them all. Or both. CD. Why does this look like after a one night stand? No, just kidding. No, they wouldn't be sitting that nicely on the couch. They'd be all wrinkled and... <laughs> oh my gosh, please don't. Don't even... See, this is why I decided maybe I shouldn't talk so much. SM ad. Mm hmm. Let me not forget about this little thing right here. Oh, yes. <laughs> These shots, though. Why? See, I'm telling you, why does this look like he's out having a fun night with someone? <laughs> it's not even nighttime, what am I saying? It just reminds me of only friends. Anyways. Okay. And my photo card, I think. Yeah, that's the back. We got... Oh, it's so cute. See, I love in the first one, I got, like, right before going on stage, makeup on, Taemin. And in, in this one, I got bare-faced Taemin. I love it. I always love bare-faced Taemin. Ooh, this one is pink on the back. I like that. I wish SM would have at least done this for NCT 127 for a fact check. All of the cards were just, like, black with a white text for everything, for all the different versions, including like the uh, poster version and the SM Mini. It was all the same, all the same. I wish they did this for them, but whatever. That's a different story for a different time. Now, I guess next we'll go through the archiving or archival, archival box version. It really looks like a shoe box. That's really cool. <laughs> it kind of actually reminds me of the, um, 17B 
Boo Sok Soon album, Second Wind. <laughs> you know that album? That reminded me of that. But this is actually supposed to be a shoe box. Well, I think theirs was too, but this has like size guide on here. Can't stop the dance. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Ooh. Actually, I didn't even see this side before. Ooh, sorry. That's so cool. That, that is just so cool. Oh, there's a, an image on the bottom here. I cannot speak properly. I don't know what's wrong with me. Very cool, actually. Is that, is that all? Is there... Oh, oh, it looks like you can lift this. Oh my gosh. So cool. I don't know where that photo card is. I don't want to see it. This is very cool. It looks like you can lift Ooh, okay, so there's more goodies underneath. Changing my mind, we'll go through the stuff that was on the top. So let's just start here. It looks like a mixtape. That's really cool. That's his name in Korean right there. Obviously. <laughs> Ooh, very cool. I'll just leave the CD in here, but there you go. He hand wrote the tracks there. That's really cool. It looks like he actually wrote them on the CD. Obviously, it's printed here, but... Like, he did write that, but on here it's printed. Duh. We know that. I'm just gonna bring this here. We're just gonna pull pull it out. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just lift them up like this. Little lyrics postcards. I like how much you get in this album. Ah, oh, yes, it's, <laughs> it's kind of like the move uh, chorus part in Guilty. I really like that move. I mean, who doesn't? Hello. You look so cute. Yeah, he's given us lots of different looks in here. He's given us cute. He's given us hot guy. <laughs> Why am I so awkward? Okay. Oh my gosh, the photo card is right here. Oh my gosh. Okay, I just put it upside down. Now I wish I went through the stuff at the bottom of the box. Okay, I set I set my card to the side. Let's go through the photo book. Should I like keep it lifted? Oh, sneak peek. Yeah, I'll just like keep it lifted up here. That's such a nice shade of brown hair. Oh, <laughs> just like underwear chilling on the ground. Oh my gosh, this is like the extra rude photo book that we love a lot. <laughs> oh yeah, I think I remember Taemin showing this one. I didn't watch it live when he did his little live before the album release because I was super tired and I couldn't stay up. But yeah, I think he showed that. <laughs> Just the random shots of the fridge. Oh, is he brushing his teeth? Some of these are the most random shots. Now he's drinking some sort of soft drink. Why does he look so good? I like, I just can't stop staring at his beautiful skin. It's like soft like a baby. It looks soft like a baby. And he is a baby, so there you go. I'm just kidding. I, I'm not actually babying him, trust me. I'm not a person that, that babies someone that's 30. <laughs> Anytime I do say he's a baby, I'm totally joking, 100%. I love outdoor photo shoots so much. Like, just, I don't know. Darkness makes me sad. So seeing, like, outside and it's bright and sunny, I love that. It puts me in a really good mood. I get really sad around darkness. Yeah. Oh, going to the liquor store? He's so precious. Ma! <laughs> My thumb just cracked. Love that. Okay, like, can my brother shut up? Oh my gosh, he really annoys me. 
You probably can't hear him, but I'm hoping not. Anytime I edit though, and I hear noises in the back, I can hear it when I'm editing, but then people comment, they can't hear it. So I think I'm, I'm going crazy. I was just in LA. I don't know if he's in LA. I can never tell, but I was just in LA couple weeks ago and the weather was so nice it was like 30 degrees and I went at the end like near the end of October like I was uh, there at the weekend of October 21st the weather was so nice and it just like compared to Japan it was so nice because in Japan it was hot but like muggy and wet but in LA it was just nice and hot and I liked it <laughs> it was really nice look at this old camper Okay, that was the photo book. Let's just go through this stuff here because there's like some goodies at the bottom here. <laughs> Look how much there is. Okay, so we have this right here. I never want to put everything back in the order that they were actually in in here. So, oh my gosh. Oh wow, shoelaces. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's been emptied. So much fun stuff. So you get an actual shoelace, but why do we only get one? You're supposed to get two shoelaces. Come on, SM. <laughs> so first we only get one photo card. Now we only get one shoelace. SM things. There you go. There's the shoelace and here's the aglet. <laughs> I learned that from Phineas and Ferb. Ever since that episode first aired, that's where I learned aglet. <laughs> okay. What are we looking at here? Okay, well, it looks like you get a little... Oh, oh my gosh, it's like a driver's license. It's like actually laminated. <laughs> that is so cool. Oh, bike rental shop membership card. Okay, I was calling it a driver's license, but that works. Wow, that's very cool. I have never seen that actually, where it's actually like laminated like this to make it look like it's laminated. You know what I'm saying? Not really. Oh my god, it's Recidify. <laughs> Wait, it looks just like Recidify. Well, no, a kid doesn't, but it just looks like a receipt. But wow, that's really cool. What did he buy here? Guilty flavor popsicle, guilty shoelace, green grape, printable photo paper, cactus pot, toy car, an orange one, black CD art disc, Ziploc bag, ice tray, bottled water, macaroni and cheese. 4 gigabyte ultra micro memory card and a bike pump. Wow. I would have never guessed. Why did that cost $815? Wait, everything was 1030. Why is everything the same price? Like tell me why a bottled water Oh, he bought 10, that's why. I was like tell me why a bottled water is 1030, but he bought 10. Gotcha. No, but what is green grape and why is it 1030? I have so many questions. And why is one popsicle 1030? Yeah, I have, I have so many questions. Anyways, there's that. I feel like I was looking at that for way too long. We have a sticker. This is so fun right now, actually. You got so many fun, like, unpredictable things in here. I'm really glad I actually did not look at unboxings of this. Like, you even have sexy photos of him. Like, I cannot complain with this. I literally can't. Ooh, is this random? I'm just pulling things out at this point. You played the fool for me. Damn. Okay, oh my gosh. You got a little pack of car- I thought this was going to be Hot Cheetos. I saw the orange and this kind of looked like flames or something. I don't know. Wow. Oh my gosh. So, okay. Is this supposed to be like your own DIY QR version? And then these are the cards. I'm gonna leave it, but obviously you, yeah, I'm gonna just, yeah. If I had an extra copy, then I would totally put that together. And then we got this right here. Oh, okay, hold on. I thought SM was being generous and giving us a bunch of selfie cards. They're not that generous. Oh, right, these, they're like close-up pictures of his eye and like stuff. Is it his lips too? I can't remember, but. I did see these going around. 
Yep, <laughs> I was right. So there's his eye. It's quite dark. I don't know if you can see it. Yes. I, we see you, sir. Yeah, pretty much just close up, really close up pics of beautiful parts of him. <laughs> oh, and his shoes. For free? No, I'm just kidding. If they were, if his socks and shoes were off, then I'd be like, for free? Who, who was out here giving free feet pics? Who was that? Was it Onyu? I swear one time he like straight up posted his feet on Instagram and we were all like, for free? What are you doing? Was it him or what? am I thinking of someone else? I swear it was him. that okay that was pretty much everything at the bottom so we'll just take out my photo card which i sat over here we got oh my gosh i think i've seen this one i think i've seen this one i was trying to like avoid any spoilers you know i'm a changed person i used to like instantly right when an album released i would rush to see what the cards looked like and these days i like try to save it as a surprise for my unboxing but oh he's so cute he's so squishy squish squish poke pinch okay anyways yes that was pretty much everything of this version yeah that was a lot to unpack but i was living then we got the two small little guys here we'll finish oh not finish we'll do the digi pack first i like that they did a digi pack for him and not the poster version because you know i was thinking about it i was like which one do i prefer i'm not sure i, I actually think i prefer the Digi pack because it has a spine, you know. Yeah, it's a little bit nicer than the poster version. Ooh. Ooh. There you go. Yes, me worshiping. Demon. Okay. I like that this is different. Oh, I love this outfit on him. There's something about baggy hoodies that I like, or like oversized hoodies that I love so much. And I like that his hair is a little bit darker here. I know I was saying I really like his brown hair, and I do, trust me, I really, really love his brown hair, but oh my gosh, legs for days. He was just wearing this outfit, I think. Not just, but he was wearing this outfit for like one of the music shows, yes legs for days but yeah um i i really do love his black hair so i'm always extra excited when i see him in black hair but i think it's just dark brown here i knew i was skipping a page it looks so good it's crazy like some of the pages keep sticking are you okay okay Moving on, moving on. We're, we're good. SM add, and then we have the photo card. Is that front or back? Oh, is that, oh, is this front? <gasps> cute. Oh, I just, I love this gray shirt he's wearing. He looks so cute. <laughs> See, I like that all the backs are different for each version. Good job, SM. You did something right with that. That's such a cute card. Okay. <laughs> And very lastly, we'll go through the SM Mini. There's only one, right? I messed up for Dio. I thought there was only one and there was actually two. And I'm hoping there's actually only one for payment as well. Yeah, I really hope I didn't mess up there again. Whoops. There you go, SM Mini. Yes, we, we get it. <laughs> Is that a broken car windshield? Alright, moment of truth. Last photo card. He looks like a schoolboy here. <laughs> I love it. We got... Oh my gosh, I got hoodie, tame in. I haven't seen all the cards, so I'm sure maybe all of them are him in a hoodie for this. You know what, probably not. Anyways, <laughs> but I got the hoodie, tame in, with his little hair curling up 
so cute so precious wait i just realized he changed his signature <laughs> he changed his signature for um his solo work i guess yeah it's like not the same <laughs> I'm guessing that's why he changed it because he wants to like differentiate him as a soloist and him as a shiny member but um yeah I'm I'm already missing his, his old signature. I wish I mentioned that earlier. I was too distracted by his heart looking like a bird. Anyways yeah that's also another another topic to talk about another time because we don't have time right now but yes anyways there you go. So that was my unboxing of Tame and Guilty. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!